Hi, Greg Vincent here from realestateindustrynewsletter.com.au. Uh, this is part three of a three-part series uh, to help real estate agents in relation to uh, when they're putting their properties onto the major portals and how they can actually maximise the value that they're, you know, whatever they're spending on uh, those major portals. So, in this third part, <coughs> what I wanted to talk to you about is there's two trains of thought within the real estate industry. One is uh, basically a short copy advertisement and minimal number of photos and the other one is what we call a long copy. Now with a short copy the thought behind that is that a lot of agents feel that you should only put minimal information in that advertisement to try to encourage people to phone you and or phone the office so you get a chance to speak to the client. So there's a lot of agents who look at that side of things you know see the benefit of you know talking to the client and trying to convert them into an appointment. And then there's the long copy where there's a lot of people who, when they go onto the internet, they want to get a lot more information on the internet without actually having to deal with the agent as much as they possibly can. And the benefit of long copy is that by actually giving all of that information about the property to the browser over the internet, then basically when they do contact the agency, they're not going to ring you and ask for small uh, silly little things like land size or you know just basic little information they're actually going to have that and what they're going to do is they're going to contact the agency and basically book an appointment with the agency from there so there's, there's as I said there's two trains of thought it depends upon which way you want to go but one of the things you can do is you can do, do a thing called split testing and I recommend you do this where some of your ads what you do is you do a short copy version and then on the other properties you can do a long copy version and just test and measure the level of the inquiry that comes through because on the short, short copy version you'll get a lot of inquiry coming through but a lot of it's just basic questions and you ha it takes up a lot of your time and the long copy version should be more qualified people contacting your agency and wanting to book in appointments. So this is uh, this has been Greg Vincent from realestateindustrynewsletter.com.au and I hope you've enjoyed this uh, series of trying to help real estate agents about what they need to do when it comes to the major portals.